Hey, first size specimen uh, from Tenke Fungurumu, Katanga Copper Crescent in the Congo. We have a matrix of pretty solid dolomite, some vugs of cobalt and calcite in the dolomite, and then as we take it over this way, we have a lovely section here. It's almost, um, let's see if we can zoom in a little bit, a little bit underexposed here. See if we can get some more. It's a, a lot lighter than this, actually. Uh, the crystals in this section, we most likely looking at some heterogenite. Now, what we have here is a thin crust of cobalt and calcite. Uh, on top of that, we have druzy quartz. So these little white crystals you see over it, like a snow-capped mountain, a pink mountain. Uh, we have the uh, druzy quartz, and then in between that, that green crystal over there, I suspect is vesignite. I talk under correction though. Um, let's just zoom in over there. I think those are actually uh, a vesignite crystal sitting on top of the um, the cobalt and calcite. May may actually be. Yeah, I think they're sitting on top of the. The, the druzy quartz. So you have underneath you have the cobalt and calcite, uh, then the druzy quartz, and these guys sitting on top of that. Uh, I wonder if there is some carcicola in this one. I think there would be traces of carcicola. There's a little bit of carcicola as well. So we have quite a quite an array of different minerals on this piece, uh, all and, and very aesthetic too. Uh, point of display, I'll turn it around slowly, it's actually quite a big piece, so, so we could display it like this. Um, more obvious display would be around like this, take it all the way around. This would be the back section, the back view, which is also pretty appealing, actually very, very aesthetic. Snow-capped mountain all from the uh, Tenke Fungurumo deposit in the Congo.